Hello? Please help me. You're not Vir Lane. My name is Seraphin. I am what you see, although I long to be free of this curse. What are you doing in this awful place? Roslyn? She tried to free me, but Vir Lane returned and overpowered her. This is his laboratory. He experiments on me, hoping he can use my blood to heal the wounded. It's madness. I'm afraid he drugged Roslyn with my blood. My blood, my strain of this curse, induces deep dreaming. When I bite someone, they later fall into a deep sleep with horrific nightmares. A concentrated dose of my blood has the same effect immediately. I hate what my hunger does. She sleeps in the next chamber, but soon she'll awake with my curse. There's a vial of my blood in the laboratory across the hall. We can use it to create an antidote. Release me, please. Thank you. I... I need a moment to recover my strength. Verilane's notes are in the laboratory if you need help with the antidote. I'll meet you at Rosalind's side. I haven't fed in a long time, and I shouldn't be alone with her. Oh, my head. Who are you? Did Seraphin send you? Who are you, stranger? And where am I? What's happened? Viralane? Surely you're joking. Why would... Wait, it's coming back to me. I was looking for harpy feathers in the forest, but a blood fiend attacked me. I fled into this cave, and I found Seraphin here in a cage, but then... Oh, my head... That's horrible! No wonder I noticed traces of vampirism. Yes, vampire blood can speed recovery, but it's very risky. I know Vera Lane thought our methods were slow, but still... We must confront him. Together, if Seraphin's willing. Oh, thank you. My mind is a little foggy yet. We should head back immediately. I have to check on my patients, and perhaps add Seraphin to them. I think I can cure her if that's what she wants. I'm so glad it worked. Is she going to be all right? At least I finally did something good with this curse of mine. I hope she takes down that monster, Verilane, and makes him pay for all this. Oh, I'm so angry I could rip his throat out. No, that's my curse, not me. I need to end this somehow. Of course I'll help. Anything to bring that monster down. Even if it means allowing others to see what I am. All right, I'll make my way there. Sometimes Vera Lane said that the mere sight of my eyes unnerved him. Well... He's seen nothing yet. I'm busy. Very busy.
I had to do it, Roslyn. It was the only way to guarantee their recovery. You were poisoning them, Alexis. Look around you. Talk to Master Healer Verlaine. I want to hear what he has to say for himself. And I would like to think that some small part of him regrets what he's done. You should talk to Master Healer Verlaine. I'd like to hear him try to weasel out of this. You should talk to Master Healer Verlaine. I'd like to hear an admission of guilt from his own mouth. Oh, I suppose you're here to fling more baseless accusations at me, too. Who are you to speak against me? What do you know of the work I do here? Such smugness. You may get rid of me, but doing so will spell doom for dozens of those poor souls out there. My methods were unconventional, yes, but they would have worked. The regrettable means to a greater end. The vampire will live forever, but those people outside won't. If one suffers so that many more can go on to lead full lives, what of it? I could have saved hundreds, no, thousands more. In time, I would have perfected it. In time, it would have been safe. Sometimes we have to make hard choices. How can you not understand that? I'm done talking. Do what you will with me, but I'll be proven right. You'll see. Unbelievable. I guessed it was something like that, but still. Let's talk, adventurer. So let me make sure I've got this right. Vera Lane's been dosing our patients with vampire blood as some sort of medical experiment? And he was ready to kill Rosalind to cover it up? You've got proof, right? Nightmares, abductions, mad experiments. Vera Lane has much to answer for. Thank you, adventurer. We're doing good work here. And because of you, we can start again and do it right. The Society of the Steadfast is in your debt. Thanks to you, I think these soldiers may actually see their families again. And maybe they'll take the lessons of this manor and do their part in bringing the war to an end one day. My work here is just beginning. My body's been healed for some time now, I guess. But now I think something in my spirit needed to be here too, helping others. Is it strange to say I don't really want to leave? Alexis Viralane, I swear by the Society of the Steadfast, you will answer for your crimes. The Steadfast? I thought you were willing to do what it took to end this war. Clearly, I was wrong. <laughs>